Dallas County Government Center, Precinct 2 in Mesquite. Got a wheelchair ramp here. Constable A. Nichols, Precinct 2. No guns, no guns allowed. I think they've got, uh, yeah, they've got both of them. 30.07 and 30.06. 30.06 says you cannot have a concealed handgun on the premises. 30.07 says that you cannot have a, uh, you cannot open carry a handgun on the premises. Justice of the Peace, Bill Metzger, Precinct 2. Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. They're pretty leisurely hours. No weapons or explosives may be brought into the building. So I messed up today, guys. I forgot to leave my wallet in my car. So hopefully I don't end up getting illegally detained and searched. ADA information. I didn't eat lunch yet either. I only had Red Bull. So now I'm shaky too. <laughs> over there, water fountain, jury room, looks like you get a number there, no I'm just doing a tour of the building, I'm, I'm, I'm just doing a tour of the building, I'm okay, a tour of the building, yeah, thank you though. I can't hear you through the glass. Why are you taking a video of us? Um, I take tours and videos of all government facilities. Mm -hmm. Local, federal. For what? To post on the internet. If you get a job in the private sector, I wouldn't be able to come into your building. Birth certificate, ID requirements in Texas. Authorized court personnel only beyond this point. Hey, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Anything help me with? No, I, I told them I'm just doing a tour of the building. I do tours of all government facilities, both local and federal. Okay. So. Yeah, just doing a tour, and I'll be on my way. Okay, and what was your name, sir? I, I didn't give it. Oh, I'm Bill Metzger. Bill? Yes, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you bet. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll just get a few pictures and, and some video, and I'll be on my way.
conviction window. You want to hold it sideways. Landscape mode. That way you're going to get a better video. Yeah, you got it right. Hold the phone sideways like you are. That way you're going to get a better video. If you hold it up this way, then it's going to, it's going to give you a poor quality small uh, video. There you go. Yeah, no problem. My favorite way to get pictures actually is to do a video and then take still frames within it. Then you, you got like thousands of uh, pictures to choose from, you know what I mean? Perfect. Thank you, sir. Yeah, no problem, man. It's perfectly legal to film and take pictures in public places. I'm glad you're exercising your right to do so. You bet. Yeah? Got to cam back from the judge. <laughs> I'm glad he's exercising his rights. Now, I'm not really sure if he's allowed to actually uh, take pictures and video from back there, though, since it's not accessible to the public. That may be questionable. He may end up getting arrested for that. says cell phone use is prohibited at the counter. The problem with rules is they're not laws. And so it's more of a recommendation. You can't enforce it because there's no penal code behind it. Oh, hey, hey, how are you? I need you to follow me. I'm sorry? I need you to follow me. Under what law? Sir, the judge have asked you to step out. Yeah, please oh, okay. follow me. Thanks, sir. Is there a law that says I can't be in here? Because, sir, look, look, there's, there's case law on this, okay, and we, I'm allowed to be we, in here we, taking you, pictures. You're allowed to be in here, but we asked you to leave. Okay. You can't ask me to leave, sir. 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 I'm not, I'm not doing anything illegal here, so you can ask me, but I can respectfully decline. And I'm respecting your client. What is your name, sir? I don't need to give it. I need your ID because I'm asking you. I no, you're not going to get my ID. I don't even have it with me. You don't? No. Okay, what well, you're going to be at, what's going to happen to you because you're... You I strongly rec recommend you don't. Who are you? Dallas County Constable? You guys have already been in enough trouble. I strongly recommend well, you don't. Well, I'm recommending... You don't do anything illegal. Well, what, what, what you need to do is... Okay, yeah. Yeah, thank Well, I was, I was actually speaking to these people. I was asking them for, you know, even though... If I could speak to him calmly and quietly for a second. Yeah, just asking. I yeah. got to do a wedding right now, so okay. these people didn't want yeah, to be video. I was just so, asking them if I could. Okay. And even though I legally can, I was asking for their permission to respectfully, okay. even though I can legally film anything I can see in public. Well, you still can, respectfully yeah, asking yeah. for their permission. Thank you, sir. Okay, thank you. Appreciate you. Have a good day. I'm going to go out the way I came in. Okay. 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 Hey, you, you can have rice. Congratulations, y'all. Can I? Do you want me to make cut you guys out of the video when I post it? Don't matter either way. Okay, right on. You gotta understand, we all have rights, but you can all no, no, no. I have rights too. No, yeah, you gotta, you gotta understand right. that you gotta obey the law, not no, what you feel. You like. have to understand the law. You have to obey the law. Then I'll stand here until you learn the law. No, sir. No, you, you, you don't. Get you. your hands off of me. You are get your hands off of me. Okay. You want to do it the hard. That's assault now. You understand? No, it's not. I'm respectfully choosing to leave, not because it's law, but you because I'm choosing to. You can't make up laws, sir. I can legally and lawfully be in here. What is your name? It doesn't matter what my name is. What, what is your name? You're gonna go. You're gonna go all the way through the long way to do this. What is your name? No, whatever you do at this point. What is your whatever name? you do at this point is gonna be illegal. 
It is a First Amendment protected activity to film and you, take pictures in a public place. Yes, you can. You came but in and judge, created a disturbance. No, it's not a disturbance. You call it These people have a private sir, ceremony. The judge is not a legislator. He, you have He's a not a legislator. Sir. He can't make up a new law right now. If yes. you want to make a new law. Listen, listen, number one, you're disturbing the peace because, number one, you come in here and you're disturbing the peace. That's against the law. No, you came in and disturbed the peace. Listen Don't you, fucking yell at me like listen that. Listen to what you're doing. You are being filmed, too. Let me let you know you've been filmed as well. You're disturbing the peace as well. You no, just, no, no. You I just, was quiet. Okay, I'm going to write you a ticket. For I was me. quiet. Take that to the, I was quiet. You, get me you came in and, and became loud and belligerent. Right now, what you're getting ready to do is get a ticket. I'm going to write you a ticket for disturbing the peace. And you also, you you also disorder the conduct because we've asked you to leave. And I've told you I can legally. See, you can't ask me to leave. I can legally and lawfully be here. Okay. You can't make up laws. Okay, let's see. Call the DA. Call someone who knows the law before you do something you shouldn't do. Because I guarantee you, it's going to come down on your department hard if you do. Just figure out what you're doing before you make a mistake. What you need to figure out is that you're disorderly conduct. No, you came in disorderly. I was quiet. I was extremely right quiet. Right now, you're not quiet. You just cursed that's me because, out. That's because you no, came to no, me, no, yelling no, at me, being you. aggressive with me. No, no, Put your hands on me and tried to push me out. You've asked you to can't leave. do that. Yes, you you can't do that. Leave. You're allowed you've, to enforce. You've been asked to leave, and you're not. You're allowed to enforce the law. You Get just, your hand off of me. You, you have been asked to leave. Get your hand off of me. Okay. Your job is to enforce the law, not do whatever you want. Sir. Sir, just... Please go on now. Thank you, sir. We're trying to get some business done. You okay? Thank they got a private deal going on, and you're disturbing them. You understand at this point it's a matter of he's trying to enforce unlawful law. I was on my way out the door, Please right? Keep, yes, sir. Please. You said you would go out the way you came in. And then he decided to start trying to assert unlawful authority. That's what I stand against. That's what I'm here for, okay. right? I don't know. I'm just asking. You said you were going to leave. I'd appreciate it. And then he started trying to assert unlawful authority. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you, you can't assert unlawful authority. Yeah. So just thank you, sir. Yeah. Have a good day. All right. Thank you, Judge. I appreciate you being respectful and cordial, and Thank you, sir. YouTube will appreciate it, too. <clears throat> hey, how you doing? Yeah, I got this young man. I've been, he's been filmed, too. So he's, he's, we're gonna, we're gonna, um, he's, he's inside the court to judge that. We're actually outside the building, the judge of us going to leave. And uh, he's refused, he refused to leave. He said it's his, his right to stand where he wants to in film at the Mesquite office. Yeah, he's, he's at the door right now. He's just being belligerent, and he's asked to leave. And so he, he's not, he didn't want to leave. He said he's got the right to film and take uh, videos of who he wants, where he wants, and he has his right. That's what he's saying. So he's got some video cam taken uh, video and I'm also video him as he. Well, the judge basically he said he said he believed he get ready. So, well, it's up. But I'm sitting there and uh, so you still refusing to leave, sir? Is that what you're saying? You want to give his name? You want you want ID? He's uh, he want to give ID? He want to give anything? So we we have him on video as well. So so we got. Hey, is your supervisor on his way out? Well, I'm just saying what you want to be standing in the vestry right here in the front. So, who's he? Uh huh. Okay. Is your supervisor on his way out at this point? Is your supervisor on his way out at this point, sir? A. Jones, is your supervisor on his way out? You got somebody looking up the laws? A. Jones, you have somebody looking up the laws? You understand you can't just make up laws, right? You can't just push people around and force people around however you want. Your job is to enforce law, not to make it up. Got the judge right here. So are you gonna go ahead and leave now? I was waiting for him to come out with me. I was waiting for his supervisor, so. He contacted me. He put hands on me. So now it's a now it's actually a criminal issue. And so at this point, what's that? Oh well, that's okay. Hey, yeah. you just please step outside. We're about to close our doors. We got a lock. Okay. Lock up our doors. We're okay. Come on out, Jones. We're waiting for your supervisor. No, you can go yeah. out. No, so if you, I'll come out when you come out. You don't. So you can leave. I'll go back in there. You've been asked to leave. I'll go. What's that? We're now closed. Okay. 
What time is it? It's time for us to close our doors. It's 341, so you guys close at 4. It says it right there on the, on the window. I know, but the day we're closing a little early, okay? No, we don't pay you to close early. That's... Yeah, that's, you guys are just, you make up your own rules, right? right we, 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 are, we are in charge of you. We're in charge of you. We the people. You guys just make up your own rules. That's why people like me are out here. You understand? And I'm glad, but if you'd please just leave, then you said you would leave, and I appreciate it. Well, that. I need him to come with me. If you can tell him to come with me, I'll leave with him. Sir, I don't, I don't work for you. Shut up, sir. You shut up. Sir. You have done this on the thought. Sir, now. you have done this you are getting loud and belligerent. You need to shut your mouth, do your job, get out of the building. What's that? I've asked you nicely. You just okay. Can you ask him nicely to come with me? I, I I've got to get his. I don't have any authority over him. Okay? I, and you don't have any authority well, either, over me either. In the courthouse, I do. Okay. So. All right. I don't, I don't want to have to do any contempt charges. That's not the right thing. So if you just step okay. outside. Can you, can you get him to come out? Ask, you could ask him nicely. Yeah, just as you've asked me nicely to leave, and I chose to. Sir, come on. Come on. Come on out. Thank you, sir. Come, come on. Come on out. You can stay here. You can stay here. If you want to stay here or not, you're going to be ticket. That's what you're going to get. I'm just waiting for him. We're going to write him a ticket. He can, he can, he can fight him. I just need a supervisor. Yes, if he stays in here, he may be able to get His away from me. supervisor's name's on the door if you want to call their office. Okay. I just can't. Criminals run. If I go out and he locks me out and goes out the back, he may run away. He's not going to run anymore. Criminals run all the time. Okay. You know that. Well, you just said, you just said earlier you would look, go ahead and leave. I, I know, but he was... He, he was coming with me, and like I said, after I said I would leave, he decided to get belligerent and try to push me and make unlawful laws. And the whole point of this is teaching you guys you can't make up laws. No one's making up a law. Okay. Do you understand contempt? Yep. If we charge you with contempt right now, he, go, he can go to jail, and I don't want to have to go do that. You said you'd leave. I'm just asking you to go on. You've got plenty of video. Jones, are you coming? I, yeah, but I need to get his supervisor well, I don't out know. here. They call. That's his name. Ray Nichols. Call Mr. Nichols. He's this elected is constable. Just call Mr. Nichols' office. That's all you can do, okay? So thank you. That's, well, I'm sorry, but we're tired of police not being held accountable. We call, we have thousands of people call, and nothing ever happens to them. I don't know them. about thousands. I'm just we do. You can do. On a regular basis, we have thousands of people call. I don't call. know what other people do. Okay. I can just tell you about me and you, because that's all that's here right now. Okay. That's all. And you've been respectful, but I, could you respectfully ask him to come out with me? If he doesn't want to go, he has a right to be here. And he works here. And if I don't want to go, I have a right to be here. So, so I'm respectfully offering to leave with him. But if you don't want to go, I've asked you nicely, sir. I understand that. Just step out so we can get get on. We got. Come on out, Jones. I've got to do Come on my out. job today, sir. You go out. See I'm how right. belligerent and angry he is. I'm a human being. He shouldn't even be a right. cop. He's too. I he's out of right. control. Listen, I'm a human like you. Do you bleed? Do you bleed? What's your problem, do man? Do you bleed? What's your problem? Ask a question. Do you bleed? You're gonna try to find out. Do you bleed? No. You're gonna try to find out. No, sir. We're, We're asking you to please step out. Come on out. Thank you, sir. Come on out, Jones. You're a human. We're both human. Come on out. Okay, let's go. Oh, Come on out. Thank you, sir. Yeah, oh, thank you, sir. I appreciate you. Thank it's you. the best thing you can do. Be at peace. Go at home. Go home. I'm at peace. <clears throat> so, I mean, you just told me you'd live up to your word. I'm just asking, would you please just step on so we can. I got a lot of work to do right now. Okay? Thank you for coming out today. I appreciate it. Judge, we, we can stay here with you, mother. Let's stop there. Yeah. Thank you, sir. So I got a ceremony, private ceremony. Your super brother on the way, Jones. Try to keep it quiet. Try not to disturb people. Man, you know, Shh. You know, you know, Shh. In the name of Jesus, I have the right, I have the freedom. I have my first right just like you. Okay. I have all my rights just like you have your rights. All right. But I have authority as well. You have authority. You don't have authority to shut the church. You have authority to move. Shh. Okay. Shh. Shh. You're creating a disturbance. Shh. I need you. You're creating a disturbance. I need you to quiet down. I need you to quiet down. Shh, quiet down. Yeah, okay. Quiet down. You're creating okay. a disturbance. Oh, yeah. Whatever, dude. Yes, sir. I can't go into detail now. I'm just at the corner of, uh, in the front of the building. Uh, where the mosquito got away in uh, my grill. Oh, yeah, but the to leave. He was being with the family and video. The judge was asking him to leave. He refused to leave. So he just stood in the front video. He said he had a right. We can't tell him what to do. He had all the rights. He refused to leave. The judge have asked him several times. Our, our cameras are on. The judge has filmed him. We all film each other. Yes, he's standing at a truth in the front of the building. Because he said he has rights and he don't want to leave.
Yeah. He's playing the 25 minutes good. No. No. That's what a tyrant looks like. Yeah. W. Uh, blue uh, jacket, blue jeans, black uh, shoes, long beard, red. Hair. Long red beard. Ginger beard. Nobody. Don't be scared. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm very good. <laughs> Once again, guys, we're at the Dallas County Government Center, Precinct 2, Mesquite. We got Constable Jones out here making up laws. Yes, he's on county property. Mm -hmm. I got a so good. Some sort of uh, pusher. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Well, it was going to be when Judge asked him to leave. Yeah, he was. He said he refused to leave. No, he videoed him until he finished videoing. Uh, it sounded like he wanted to speak to a re reporter, but he wanted someone to answer his question. It sounded like to me. But they wanted what? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Is that your supervisor, Jones? Could have been over about 20 minutes ago, huh? You just acted right. You can't act right, can you? you? Can't act right, can you, Jones? You used to just being able to tell people what to do despite what the law says, aren't you? That's not the way it's going to go anymore. You need to do what you have to do, man. Did you ever been asked to leave this the fourth time, fifth time, whatever we? Told you. Okay, you can ask me to leave, but I can we've legally already, and lawfully be here. Told we've already told you. The judges gave you a question. And I can legally you. and lawfully okay. be okay. here. Just let it be known that you was asked. Don't tell you. Don't say you wasn't asked. You wasn't told. You were told and asked. Both you, ways. You can't tell. You can only okay. ask. Okay. 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 Had you not stepped out of line, this would have been over 20 minutes ago. Back to blue. You've been recording the whole time, right? I sure hope so. How long have you been a cop, Jones? I think it's pretty sad that somebody who's supposed to enforce the law doesn't even know it, he just makes it up. Don't you think that's pretty sad? I mean, if you want to make up laws, be a legislator, you know what I mean? Just go be a legislator. You can make up all the laws you want then, right? All you got to do is have enough money and you can get the law passed. Got an unmarked unit. Pulled up just now. Illegal tent. Plate number JLR four one one two. Up, man. You hey, you have to leave by the judge. You have to leave the property. Is that a law? Can you show it to me? If you can show me the law, I'd be happy to obey it. Well, here, here's the deal. At this point, when you've been asked to leave, it's trespassing. 
Which, well, it's public property. It's county property, therefore it's public. Anything that's accessible to the public, I can be here. Now, I don't understand the rules on if a judge told me to do something, whether it needs to be in legislation or not. If you can show me that law, then, then I'd be more than happy to obey it. If there's no law and it's just, you know, the wishes of a man, you know, I've got a lot of wishes for a lot of people to do a lot of things, you know what I mean? It doesn't mean I can force them to do it. I'd be more than happy to comply if you could show me a law. Okay. Here's the deal. We're not going to sit here and discuss what's going Is there something that you're trying to do up here? Well, I was just doing a tour of the building and getting a video of it, and I was actually pretty much done on my way out, and uh, this gentleman came in and, and uh, decided to try to push me out. Um, I was just about done anyways. It would have been maybe one or two minutes max. But he decided to start making up laws and telling me that I have to do things that I know dang well I don't have to do. And at that point, the whole idea of doing this is to show cops like him, you don't get to tell us what to do just because you feel like it. If there's a law, then please enforce it, right? But you don't get to just come around and boss people around and tell them what to do because you feel like telling people what to do, right? And so at that point, even though I was on my way out, I've got to, I've got to make the point that, no, I'm not going to leave because you told me to. I was leaving because I was done, and, I, and honestly, out of respect for some people, got a wedding going on in there. Right. If, they weren't, if they weren't in there, too, I wouldn't have even gone as far as I did. I wouldn't have even left and gone out. As, why? Because I legally can be there. I chose to leave out of respect for them. At the point where he decides to assert unlawful authority, now I have to make my stand, right? I understand. Here's the deal. If we're given an order by the judge, we work for the courts. <laughs> okay. So if the judge tells me we have to leave, then we've got to abide by his just, like I said, just show me that law that says, I, I'm not saying it's not there, that if the judge says I have to do something, no matter what, anywhere I'm at, public property, private property, as far as I understand it, if I'm in his courtroom, then basically anything he says goes, legislation right. or not, but not in the building as far as I understand it. If I'm incorrect, please show me the law, and like I said, I'll be happy to comply and leave. We can look up the law. We don't bring the law book out. Well, that's... You see, you see how ridiculous that is, though, because a lot of times cops arrest people without even knowing what the law is. It's, so literally what you're doing then is you're arresting someone based on the fact that you don't like what they're doing. No. But Wait. if you could find the law, though, then you could say, oh, okay, this is the law. Um, we're telling you that that's the law. Are you still going to choose to disobey it? You know? Right. Otherwise, you'd be arresting me and going, I hope there's a law somewhere that I can charge him with, right? We'll, we'll see. We don't <laughs> make arrests without going by the law. Okay. All I'm saying is I would be happy to leave and, and even not come back if it were the law, right? right? You would never see my face here again, but I, I truly don't believe that it is the law. And I haven't seen it yet, and I've had a lot of people try to show it to me, and it's not there. You know what I mean? Right. See. And like I said, this wouldn't have escalated to the point it was. I was quiet in there. I didn't say a word to anybody. I was, I was reading signs, but I got my phone up to my face, and I'm speaking quietly into it, so even the people next to me can't hear what I'm reading off. As to make sure not to make a disturbance, just do a, a tour of the building, right? Right. Notice, and it didn't get loud and belligerent until off. The judge uh, says, leave. And he mm -hmm. told me to leave. He said, I, I can't, you can't tell me to leave. I leave when I want to. That's what he said. It's on can't phone tape, too. That's the gist of it. I don't know if those were exact words, no, but I, I would definitely well. agree that's that that's yeah. the gist of what I said. Hey, how you doing? What's your name? Still Wagner. Still, Still Wagner? Uh, just trying to He's trying to find a law. We're trying to. I'm, I'm just trying to find a law. That's all. The law as far as what? For criminal trespassing? Or yeah, for... yeah, on, on public property. Okay, well, if the judge is asked to leave, I don't know what the reasons are behind that yet. Right. So, so, just like a business owner, same thing. That's the thing, though. This isn't a private business. You know, right. if I were to go over there to Best Bail Bonds, that's a private business. Uh -huh. The second they tell me I need to leave, I better get out of there, right? Or I'm going to... This is not a, a, a private business. I own this. You own this. You own it. We all own it. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. So why... So all Why I'm, are we here right now? Why are we at this junction right now as far as the judge was wanting you to leave? So he, get that bad? he had asked me to, uh, honestly, it was just because I was filming. That's why he asked me to leave. Okay. Um, and uh, he filmed me back and I told him, great, I, I really appreciate you doing that, judge. I, I appreciate you also exercising your First Amendment right to film in public. Okay. okay? Um, Right? Nope. No, you got. You, you got. I don't get. I don't get. I don't. You don't have an idea. I don't. What's your first name, sir? I, I'm not going to give it. And let, I mean, all I'm asking is sh show me the law and tell me why what I'm doing that's illegal. If you can educate me on that, then please do. Well, I haven't got the story yet. I just showed. Okay. Up. That's why I was trying to ask you. Exactly okay. How we got to where we are now. Okay. All I'm asking is is show me where it's because it, every time I've done this before, I go in and I'm quiet. I get the pictures and video that I want and I leave. 
you know, they've escalated this. They've made it a, a big issue. Okay. Um, and so if you're telling me that there's a law that, that thousands of people that have been doing this legally can't do it anymore, then please show me the law and I'll stop doing it. Okay. But other than that, I mean... I was I'm, just trying to figure out if you had business here. That's all I was trying to do. Did the judge ask you to leave? Did the judge ask me to? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. What it amounts to is that's his court. Okay. okay. And that, that doesn't just mean his, his chambers. It means the court. Okay. Okay. Um, if you don't have business with the county, then you really don't have any business here. Okay. Um, so he's, I, he's I'm, asked you to leave. And otherwise, it's going to be criminal trespass if you refuse to leave. Is it? Is it? Yes, it is. Okay, listen, please. I'm, I'm listening to you. Please listen to me. Is it? Is it unreasonable to ask you to show me that law? Well, I don't actually have that law on me. Maybe but we. You're welcome maybe, to look it up. Okay. I'm, if you know what Google is, then you're welcome. Yeah. To look the only thing is, I'm filming with criminal trespass. Okay. I'm actually filming with my phone. Otherwise, I, I, I would personally that. look yes, it up right it. now. I get it. I get it. But you're trying but, to tell me to do something without showing me a law that I backs up your. To show you the law. Well, your authority is under the law. It's not under your whims. You under, and and you so I'm just. Leave or you go to jail for criminal trespass. You know, if you if the judge you, has asked you to leave the court. You understand that you can't trespass somebody off of public property, right? If you're causing a disturbance. You can't. I wasn't causing a disturbance. Jones was. So. Jones was. Well. I wasn't causing a disturbance. I got Jones was. Disturbance, so. Well, of course, that's what they always say. Disturbance. That doesn't. I mean, I could say that you're causing a disturbance, you know? That, that's, you, you're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to back that claim up though, aren't I? Right? I'll tell you this. Okay, a lot if of- If you come in and spoke with the court and ask for permission to do this, I'm sure they wouldn't have minded in the least bit. They would have been glad to have- So you're telling me I've gotta ask for permission to exercise rights. That's not a right. No, that's, that's a permit. I didn't say you had to. I'm saying if you had done that- Why? Because it's a right in the first place. Show me where it's a right. The first, show me it's where a first it's a right. journalism. No, show me where it's a right. Journalism is a First show Amendment right. I'm filming. Right. I'm filming with my phone. I can't. Right. That's First Amendment. What says what? The right to the press. And what we'll do then is we'll bring back about ten or fifteen people to come and film Jones. We'll be quiet. We'll keep our. We won't say a single word. And Jones will probably lose his mind again and try to assault somebody like he did. So. Jones, I already told you, man. We're done with you. Man. You know, all I'm saying is Jones, Jones doesn't even know what law is. He thinks he can just push people around and tell them what to do. That's not the way it works, Jones. That's not what we hired you to do. Hey, uh, I didn't get your name and, and badge number. I'm definitely Hubbard. My Hubbard? 221. Hubbard 221. All right. A lot of our, my viewers like to call in and uh, let people know that uh, they're dissatisfied with Jones. They also like to let people know that they're very satisfied with your work. They like to give compliments too. If we're gonna throw trash under the bus, we also need to show respect for people who show respect to us, so. All right, thanks man, I really appreciate it. So they're closed for the day. They closed at four. 